Today I'm going to look at Masonic Mosaic, which is a collection of some of my articles that I've had published over the years. It's published by a Spanish Masonic publisher called Masonica. They have their own website, so you can check those in the links below. And uh, it was a great idea at the time because uh, I've been publishing articles and uh, papers for, for about 20 years and never had a collection. Someone just suggested it and we went with it and it was great to see them all together and it's uh, sold quite well. Uh, it brings together some articles that I've had in Freemasonry Today, which is a UK Masonic magazine. Um, the Square, which was another one based in the UK. Uh, the Philolethus, which is a US based journal, a very nice journal that mainly deals with uh, light academic works. And the Knights Templar magazine, which was a great little magazine, still going, that's based in the US. And they published quite a number of little articles for me in the early days. And there's a number of other ones as well from over the years. So it was great to put them together. This is my second collection. And I like to bring together themes really when I when I put together these so uh, obviously this looks at uh, characters Masonic characters from over the years over the centuries and also uh, literary figures uh, that were Freemasons such as Sir Arthur Conan Doyle that's a short story a short article about him and his occult works and Jerome K Jerome he wasn't a Freemason but uh, was one of those literary figures that was on the the uh, the edge of Freemasonry. Really, he he knew a lot of writers um, that were Freemasons, and uh, like Conan Doyle, for example. Um, so a lot of these flow into each other. Uh, they work quite well together. And Thomas De Quincey, um, that's a nice piece that I managed to get into. Uh, the AQC Journal, uh, and the illustration there is by uh, a good friend of mine, German Freemason, Karl Jans Rusch. And it opens up with an article that I wrote about Bram Stoker, who was a Freemason. Um, quite a nice article. So, yeah, I've given them um, little introductions as well. Um, where they came from, where they were originally published, what inspired me, uh, Authors Forward. Um, it's a beautiful book, really. It's, it, uh, Masonica really puts together these nice uh, Masonic books. And uh, I was quite pleased with this one. Uh, it's a very nice book. And it's great to put articles together like this and um, have them available for people because you always get requested. Um, about um, there's always requests about articles that you've done in the past so um, Masonic Mosaic published by Masonica and available on the Masonica website and that's in the links below